your hearing checked for free at Evolution Hearing. Patchum or the people and congregations engaged in ministry started at seasonal emergency shelters this past weekend. Jay James spoke with the organization's executive director and has more on the shelters and events they have planned for this year. Well, thanks, guys. October means that cold weather is on the way, and there's a great local organization that's helping people in our community. And let's talk with them today, the executive director of Pacham. People and Congregations Engaged in Ministry is with us, and that is Ms. Dawn Grigorchak, who joins us. And hello, it's good to see you. Hi, J. James. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Thanks for coming down. So I'm sure there are people in our community who are not familiar with Pacham. And if they're not, just kind of tell us what you guys do. Okay, Pacham is a seasonal shelter of last resort. We're open from the end of October through the end of March, the coldest months of the year here in the Charlottesville area. So um, those five months, we open every night to those who would otherwise be sleeping on the streets um, or in doorways. There are folks who are not for for a variety of reasons, eligible for some of the other shelters here in the area. So. Now, Don, you had, uh, I understand this past weekend was a big weekend. Tell us why. Yes, um, Saturday night was our opening night, and um, a little over 30 individuals came to us at 5.30 at night, right outside the Haven, looking for shelter with us. And it was a bit of a bittersweet reunion for some of our seasonal staff who've been with us year after year. They recognized some of these folks as people have stayed with us before and so there was a lot of hugging and smiling people glad to see each other again wishing they were better circumstances hmm. now in our last few moments here tell us about churches provide shelter with this how does how That's does that whole right. dynamic work Right, we use a rotating um, congregational shelter model, so um, individual congregations in the Charlottesville Albemarle area agree to host either the men or the women for one or two weeks at a time. They open their um, their, con their doors uh, to their places of worship and, and welcome our people in, um, provide them with good food, good fellowship, and a safe place place to sleep, a warm place to sleep, so that the next morning they're rested and, and ready to take on the, um, you know, the tasks of the day where they really need to work hard to um, better their lot and take the steps they need to take to get out of homelessness. It's a wonderful initiative. I can, I can hear your heart as you're, as you're talking to us about it. How can people find out more or help you guys do this? Uh, go to our website, pachamshelter.org. You can find out about our latest fundraising raising efforts. You can um, find out staff contact information. Contact us directly. Call 973-1234. Mm -hmm. Ask to speak to Jesse or myself. We're happy to talk with you further about the program mm. and how you can get involved. Talk to your congregational leaders. Ask if you're involved with Pacham. If you are, I'm sure they could use your help. We, we can use all hands on deck for this season. Mm. Um, and if you're not involved, talk with those leaders and say, you know, hey, let's get involved in this. It's, it's, it's an incredible opportunity to be connected with neighbors that you might ordinarily not meet. Dawn, thank you for your service and thank being you. here today. Thank okay? you. Appreciate right. it. That's Dawn Grigorchek with Pacham. Guys, back to you. All right. Thanks, Jay. Coming up, our next.